I'm now going to show you the magic wand tool um, and you get to it by W on the keypad and the magic wand tool came first before the quick selection um, tool so we're going to go through this one first so that it's quite straightforward to use it's like a, a fairy's wand you click on an area and it will then find um, all of the pixels are the same color and density up to an edge and make a selection now can you see here it's not included this part because if I get rid of it go select deselect it's slightly lighter than the area up here so then we have tolerance which is the ability then to change how much of that color and tone we pick up in the selection so the higher the tolerance the more it will include if I put that tolerance quite far down it will be very specific to the color that I initially click on so if I put this up to say to 50 and then click yeah that's a little bit more it's, it's included all of that lighter area of the blue um, and it's still kept within the edges if I was to deselect and increase that to say maybe 90 it might oh no it's still done it because I think what it is is it's just an, a definite blue with the yellow it's kept that crispness so sometimes it will start including too much so getting the right tolerance um, value is really important for you to to have a, a nice outline around your subject so the magic wand is um, very quick and easy to use so when you've got such a definite um, selection area from one to the other like we have here if I click on it it will should select it all lovely um, however if it doesn't and initially it was giving that kind of banding down here you can increase your tolerance to start including more of a tonal range around the initial selection point so the magic wand is um, is a nice easy quick tool for selecting an area but it has to be within the defined point otherwise it won't pick it up so you can see here I haven't got this part and this part selected because it's only taking it up to the edge and because the yellow of the leaf goes all the way to the edge there and all the way to the edge there it's not picked in those areas I can add in those selection um, and I can choose to to add by pressing my shift key down and that will give me a plus symbol and then if I click on it it's gone to add those areas if I wanted to minus something out so say I wanted to minus that back out I instead of holding the shift I hold the alt key down and that then minuses it out so sometimes with a, a tool it might select most of what you want but then miss things out and you can just go along and add those in as and when you need by just holding the shift first then click for every part you want added in and the alt key is the minus so there I have my selection this is a selection though of the sky not the leaf so if I was to make an adjustment say image adjustment levels or control L let me change the sky let me make it a little bit darker you can see it's affecting the sky but say I wanted to uh, adjust the leaf and not the sky and um, sometimes so say I wanted to draw around the leaf sometimes it's actually better to draw around the negative space and then invert it rather than try and draw around the leaf so if I deselect if I wanted to just uh, select the leaf for example if I use the magic wand can you see it's really having a, a hard time on selecting because of all of the variety of tones and colors within it so if I wanted the leaf selected what I could do is actually just select around the and hold the shift key to add those areas in so select around the sky and then do something by going to select inverse and by inversing my selection now this is selected on the leaf and not the sky so sometimes you have to think outside the box and think well okay this is a complicated shape or it's it's got a lot of detail to it it would actually be easier for me to draw the sky selection and then invert after rather than trying to sort of get the leaf selection selected so now if I do levels so image adjustment levels I can adjust the leaf and not the sky um, because this I've inverted the selection